What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to discuss the genius of talented singer, rapper, songwriter, and record producer, Static Major. Steven Garrett, best known as Static Major's first big break, came when his group Player was chosen to be a part of the music collective group, Swing Mob. This group was founded by Jodeci member, Devontae Swing. The group eventually branched off to become the Basement Crew, and finally the Super Friends with other artists including Aaliyah, Missy, Timberland, Genuine, Magoo, and Nicole Ray. Static's group Player had learned the ropes of production and songwriting working on Jodeci's 1995 album, The Show, The After Party, The Hotel. Static Major's first solo breakthrough came when he helped pin Genuine's 1996 hit, Pony, which topped the R&B charts. Player eventually released their first album, Cheers to You, in 1998 to moderate success, achieving a top 10 hit, also called Cheers to You. Afterwards, Player took a break and Static found work in producing for Nicole Ray's debut album, Make It Hot. One of the first times working with Aaliyah, Static produced a monstrous Grammy-nominated hit, Are You That Somebody?, which he, Aaliyah, and Timbaland recorded in one night. After building a strong friendship with Aaliyah, he then became her prominent songwriter. He would go on to pin songs for her like Come Back In One Piece, featuring DMX, and her other huge Grammy-nominated hit, Try Again, which hit number one and broke Billboard and Airplay Records. Many people often contribute Aaliyah's latter musical success to Timbaland and Missy, but they tend to leave out Static Major, who played a major part in it. Static was Aaliyah's true music soulmate. Not only would Static write the songs for Aaliyah, but he would do the vocal arrangements and manipulate harmonies in a way that was fresh and relatively unheard of. This is really evident on Aaliyah's self-titled album, which she had the role of writing, vocally producing, and even singing background on most of the songs. These songs include More Than A Woman, We Need A Resolution, Rock The Boat, Loose Rap, Extra Smooth, I Refuse, Read Between The Lines, It's Whatever, Those Were The Days, and Never No More. Aaliyah's album will go on to multi-platinum success with four top 25 hits. Static will go on to write and produce for other big artists like Destiny's Child, Brandy, Pretty Ricky, Jamie Foxx, Jay-Z, and Lil Wayne, who he helped write one of the biggest hits of his career, Lollipop. Featured on Lil Wayne's Carter 3 album, released after his untimely death in 2008, Static would receive much posthumous fame for appearing in the Lollipop video. Throughout his career, Static Major has proven to be more than an ordinary songwriter and vocal producer. He really pushed the envelope and introduced new song structures and techniques that laid out a blueprint for many in the music industry to follow. Static even once said, nobody can hold me on harmony. My whole aura is not your typical R&B aura. Static Major was simply a genius, so often recognized, and one of the greatest artists of our time. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching and listening. I'll see y'all in the next video. I mean, the creative team that I have on this album is amazing. They're genius. Static is a genius writer. He um, is able to put himself in your shoes and tell a story from your point of view, and that's amazing to me.